Welcome to Illuminati Silver. We tell you the truth about silver. Today is Thursday, the 2nd of January 2020. And yesterday we produced a video entitled Your Suggestions and Recommendations for 2020. And thank you to all of those who responded. And please, if you haven't already done so, do visit and listen to that podcast and place your comments below it. And we've provided a link for your convenience below. As we really are looking at your suggestions and taking them very, very seriously indeed. Well, in our end of year forecast for gold and silver, we predicted gold and silver would end up somewhere between 1500 to 1525 for gold and $17.50 to $18 for silver. Well, on Monday evening, gold closed just before the new year at $1,517, having earlier touched $1,525. And silver closed at $17.85, having been as high as $18.14. Well, the markets have now since reopened. And at the time of writing and producing this podcast, which is 1830 GMT, gold stands at 1525 and silver at 1799. In fact, almost exactly what we predicted would be the end of the year close. Both of which have, though, been higher earlier in the day. Gold having reached 1530 and silver 1808. Now, it's important to bear in mind that despite these rises, the markets are still quite tight as volume is relatively low. But do watch out for gold. Now, all of the pumpers are promising us silver fortunes. But at the moment, our interest is in gold, at least for the next week or so. Now, we still want to see volumes early next week before giving our forecast. But frankly, we're becoming a little excited for gold, though we promise most sincerely not to get too carried away. Now, silver will have its day, but we still believe and are of the opinion that it will lag gold for a while. And there are very good economic and financial reasons for this, which we shall explain in another video podcast. Now, we're also heartened a little in that the equity profit taking for the year end did not really occur. And if Trump and Xi sign this trade deal soon, this will further help equity markets, especially as President Trump stated less than 48 hours ago that there may only be two phases to the China-US trade deal, as he hopes to get everything agreed in full by the second phase, which, if that does happen, will truly buoy equities. Now, the dollar also strengthened slightly today, but, it's, but the index is still under the 97 level standing at 96.83 at the moment. Now, we do not wish to add more right now, as volumes, as mentioned, are still somewhat slim or low, and price movements are exaggerated a little. But frankly, gold is the colour we are looking at right now, and truly cannot see, at this stage, any more than a potential $70 downside. But a potential $175 upside over the next few months. But as we stated earlier, we wish to see the volumes next week. We'll take a closer look at the COT report to speak with traders before we tie our sails to the mast. Now, we hope you had a most enjoyable New Year festivity and that you have now totally re recovered from any alcoholic-induced sore heads. Thank you for listening, and a reminder to Bronze and Silver members, we have some important emails being sent to you on Sunday and Monday coming. And meanwhile, if you haven't already done so, please subscribe to our channel, not forgetting to press the bell sign, so that you are notified as and when future videos are published. We did well with regards to recruiting new subscribers last year, and it would be marvellous if we could enlist another 2,000 or so 
and perhaps touch the 20,000 subscriber level this year. So if you're able to share our videos with friends, family or acquaintances, it would be most appreciated. Thank you so much for listening. We hope you have found this video interesting and informative. And if so, please give it a thumbs up and share it on social media. Please ensure that you have subscribed to our channel and press the bell sign so that you are notified of any future videos. Also kindly visit our website at IlluminatiSilver.com and if you haven't already done so, please subscribe either as a free or paying member for regular email updates and offers. Disclaimer. Illuminati Silver owners come from a background of banking, international wealth management and economics. Having now retired from these worlds, we are not qualified to give investment advice. Therefore, this and other productions must not be deemed to be giving such advice and merely represent the personal views of its owners. Thank <laughs> you.